Hello everybody, welcome back to another War Tales Let's Play episode. We're going after Matthias Lund. We're going to try the Matthias Lund fight. Could it end our game? Indeed it could. But we're going to try it anyway. Uh, well, we'll try it soon, sorry. In this episode, we're going to go ahead and complete this first easy task over here. And then, if we have time, we're going to go after Matthias Lund. All right, so we'll go ahead and make our way over to this mission. We'll get some money. We're going to need money to uh, to pay the troops here. But this is a border crossing. Interesting. I'm assuming... Where does this, what does this do? Let's find out. We've never been to a border crossing before. Okay, here's a merchant. Spices. I'm waiting for other caravans when passing through a warring county. It's best to do so in a large group. It discourages bandits and you can all pitch in to pay mercenaries. Okay, so he does have some raw materials. Pottery, spices, coal. Um, we're going to go ahead and sell these farmer's rags for sure. Let's see, we'll sell this rusty shiv. I don't think we have much else that we can really sell for now. We're at 125, though, so that's good. What do you have to say? People are fleeing Arthas, and you're going there? No, actually. Um, okay, I need a border pass. I see. So, uh, yeah, okay. So this, apparently, this must be maybe Region 2 that we go to once we get some sort of a border pass. So we probably have to, uh, obviously, we have to um, complete enough steps in Tiltrin to at least push the main story to allow us into the next zone. So we're going to go ahead and head up, try to complete this easy task, stop by Stromcap, turn it in, get our money. And then we head for Matthias Lund and we're going to try the Matthias Lund fight. I don't know what to expect with it. Uh, what are you people doing over here? Uh, we came to hunt for food for our families, but the criminal, the animals here, <laughs> criminals, the animals here, their calls are enough to make your hair stand on, on end. I'm mean, going to wonder if we did the right thing coming here, but now that we're here, we can't go back empty handed. You totally should. So do I want to give five? Po no, I need food. Actually, I'm going to give the influence. We'll go ahead and give him a warning. All right. Oh, that was the mission. Okay, rock on. All right, that was the mission. So we'll head back to Stromcap. We're going to head back to Stromcap. And then we will, uh, yeah. So I'll see you guys back at Stromcap. Okay, we've arrived here at Stromcap. We're going to go ahead and do some business. Collect that bounty. What other jobs we got here? Fight Matthias Lund. We're going after that one. We're going to go after that one. Let's go ahead and take this average one here. For 10 influence, I could try to negotiate it up to 204 coins. I could take it to 20 influence. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Emissaries. Okay, cool. We're going to go ahead and accept that contract for two, 204. I think I said 240. Okay. Uh, now, before we... Um, appoint captain. What is what is being a captain do? Does it give us the same bonuses when we as if we fight when we fight other people? Let's go ahead and promote Banana as our captain. Fifty influence. Let's see what happens. We're gonna grant it. Banana has been appointed captain by the troop. Okay. So, um, oh, uh, galvanized troops. You gain one rally. Point per ally in the area, usable once per encounter. That's very interesting. Okay, all right, that's interesting. Does anybody else get another one? No, it looks like just he did because he's the captain. That makes sense. Okay, cool. All right, um, we need to probably buy a little bit of food. Let's 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 buy a little bit of food here. We're starting to rack up stuff. I'm going to have to try to figure out... 
we're either going to have to kind of dive into this crafting system a little bit and see what's up, or um, we're going to have to sell some of this stuff. All right, we're going to buy some more. Okay, so that's three days worth of food. All right, cool. Okay, uh, Matthias Lund time. Old Matthias is down here. I have no idea what to expect when fighting him. We're going to give it a go, and we're going to see what happens. We've got two archers, two tanks, and a rogue that stabs pretty, pretty hard. So, you know, I mean, I've got it. I, I guess maybe I like my chance. I don't know. I, I don't know. It's rated as a hard fight, so I guess we'll see what happens. When we rest, you can see up here in the top, I've got four of seven Valor Points. That'd be great to go into that fight with the four Valor Points, but alas, I'm not going to because we have to rest. We'll get our rest on. I'm curious. Do I need to reveal location? Okay, there we go. Oh, cool. Okay, there's the Bandit's Lair, and it gets it. Most importantly, it actually gets it out of my inventory. Okay. All right, Matthias Lund, we're on the way. What to expect in the fight? I don't know. But the game scales. And so as we gain higher levels, as we gain more power, so do the enemy. So I don't think it really makes tons of sense to wait. Like, I don't think you can kind of overpower over level i don't think you can really over level things in the game because the game scales based off of the size of party you have as well as your levels so here we go we're going at matthias um let's go i'm gonna go ahead and just save because if we get wiped out we have to decide whether or not we're going to start a whole new game or not lucilla i'll kill them all oh boy uh, homie, I'm not Lucilla, and I didn't kill your daughter. He's one of her string of murders. Okay, here we go. He's a level two champion. All right, here we go. I feel nervous heading into this fight. Elites are unique enemies who can act more than once during a round. Pay close attention to the turn order to prepare your strategy. Lucilla's judgment applies judgment to the nearest enemy. This unit is targeted... Lucilla's Revenge targets and it deals 80 damage to all units in the area and knocks them 80 damage. What in the world? Holy cow, holy cow, 80 damage. That's not possible, right? I mean, he's going to wipe out everybody that I have. It's... Holy cow. All right. Well, banana banana is going to engage first. He's going to grab a spear. He's going to throw said spear. He is going to move right up to next to Matthias. Now, Banana has a few things going on. All right. Uh, the unit gains deflection. Hey, look, my Valor points didn't reset. I have six Valor points. So two from the previous day's rest, two from the fighting that I did, and then the two from the most recent. Okay. All right. Here we go. If they are engaged in combat, you gain one Valor. Well, we're not engaged yet. Damage taken... Of the next attack. Okay, actually, we are going to be engaged here because we're going to attack Matthias. Um, I do want to galvanize, but that's a small area. So first, we're going to... Let's let's attack Matthias first. Okay. Uh, wow. Oh, base action. Oh, no. Okay. All right, well... Well, we're just going to have to see what happens then. Judgment. All right. He pops judgment on me. All right. So let's look real quick. This unit is targeted. Oh, boy. So maybe maybe he only does Lucille's Revenge targets an area. This unit is writing a skill and cannot be engaged. Hmm. Maybe Lucille's Judgment only goes on the target of judgment we'll have to we'll have to see we're gonna have to see how this works okay so can i bring princess up behind him let's bring princess up so first we're gonna do this we're gonna move princess up and we're going to poison vial 
and see if we can just get Matthias. Okay. Now let's move Princess up to get right behind Matthias. All right. I don't want to burn another Valor Point. I feel like I'm going to need my Valor Points. You know what I'm saying? Like, like I'm going to move her back out because he's about to, he's going to do his judgment thing here soon. Okay, we're going to go ahead and use one of our, our archers now. And try to get... He's out of range. I could use a Valor Point to run. No, I'm not going to. Okay, here we go. Targeting. Okay. Alright, so... I should be able to move here and not get hit, right? I, I think I should be able to move here and not get hit. And then, I don't think we're going to do Ovation yet. It costs two Valor Points, but I've only got one person engaged. Man, I'm nervous. Wow. He, he one-shots us. I, he one-shots us. What in the world am I supposed to do against that? I, I don't even know what I'm supposed to do against that. I, I'm i sitting here right now with my, my jaw. My jaw is to the floor right now. Um, okay, so we're going to get absolutely wiped. I mean, it's, it's clear we're going to get wiped here. So, so... Maybe I need to come back with more people. If it's only a fight against him, if he's an elite, but it's only a fight against him, maybe it's just something I need to come back and, and well, I just need to simply fight him when I have more people to fight him. But how do I survive the fight? Or don't I survive the fight? Am I not supposed... I mean, I mean, is... I mean, think about it this way. If this game has permadeath, right? Um, is this the type of fight where it's like, look, here's the deal. Ironclad's going to have to try to keep running away, and he can't. Uh, you know, is is this the type of fight where it's like, you know, look, there's, there, there, you don't win the whole thing. It, it doesn't happen. I've only got aid on... This is going to be... This is going to be disastrous. Do I have aid on you? No, and you're dying, so you can't even use it. I think the only person who has aid on my team is Princess, and she's dying. So I, this is just horrible. I mean, this is just absolutely freaking horrible. I mean, there nothing Princess can do. Look at that. He's going to one shot whoever I put in front of him. Unfreaking real. Unreal. Um, I mean, I can, I can keep having banana run away, but it just simply delays the inevitable. I mean, do we flee the battle? Maybe we, maybe let's try to flee. Do we flee the battle? Let's, um, well, we know we're going to lose it. So instead of restarting the play, the the entire let's play over because we'll lose the game. And I, I'm not I'm not much of a save scummer. Let's go ahead and retreat. And we probably should have done that before Ironclad completely died. But you know, um, holy cow! Wow. Okay, so we don't fight Matthias. We don't fight Matthias anytime soon. Okay. We're not fighting Matthias any time soon. I have to go get heals. Um, the, the refugee leader wants to talk to me. And since we're over here, maybe we'll go talk to the refugee leader. Um, oh, man. Um, yeah, that. Uh, so he's an elite. Um, and he hurts. He absolutely, unequivocally, 100% hurts. And I can speak from experience. <laughs> All right, let's see what's over here. 
Hopefully we don't get into a fight. If we get into a fight, then that's me being uh, foolish. Matilda. We sell all our surplus to help with the cost of rebuilding this ruin. Ruin. Hey, look, medicine. I need two more medicine. Cool. Okay. Um, kind of feel like I should buy the rest, but I got to watch my money. Refugee leader. My name is Fergus. I am the former Lord Mayor of Corsia, and I now lead the refugees. It was I who requested your presence. It seems you have chosen to support the citizens of Tiltron rather than our cause. I wish I could change your mind. Perhaps offering you a mission that will be worth your while will do more than a thousand words. We have set up a woodcutter camp to the north. This remote camp was only meant to provide us with the timber necessary for firewood and rebuilding the haven. But still the Tiltron farmers continue harassing our men. I fear the situation might escalate. We haven't heard back from our woodcutters in several days. I would therefore ask you and your mercenaries to find out what happened. Yeah, sure, I'll take the job. Thank you. The woodcutters are just north of here. Okay. All right. Um, Humad, I asked Berthram to bring me everything I need to sew warmer clothing. When do you think he'll be back? Uh, yeah, so about, about Berthram. I know that Fergus and the others are doing their best, but let's face it, we won't survive the winter months if we stay here. They're trying to rebuild a village from scratch. We've got more than enough farmers, but we are in dire need of skilled craftspeople. If you find a blacksmith among the amongst the refugees, please bring them to us. We are in such a bind. We're willing to pay for your help. Hey, I've got some people who have never blacksmithed before, but I've decided that they're blacksmithers. Maybe we can make money. I'm thinking not, though. Okay, let's... Can we... How do we heal out of camp? All right, so here's Banana. Constitution Ridge. Wow, that's heal. I see. Okay. Sprain can no longer be chosen to complete tasks. Interesting. Okay. Laceration. This unit can no longer deal a critical hit. Hmm. Do we need to heal him? Yeah. We do rely on his damage. Fracture. Damage halved. Oh, we're totally treated. Interesting. Okay. So when you're going into so when you go into dying. Uh, status, it would appear that you can gain, you gain some sort of a random injury um, that you need to treat. Okay, so we've lost a companion. Um, let's go check on these woodcutter fellows over here, since they're right up north. Matthias Lund kicked our butts. So what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to load up to beat him. Uh-oh. Oh, no. All right. Six level three wolves. Oh, we could have distracted to get... Oh, we could have distracted and got away. Oh, no. No, we could have distracted... Oh, 27 hit points, too. Wow, that is a healthy number. Holy cow. Okay, um... All right, well, Banana, you're going to go do your thing. There's Princess right there. So let's have Banana square off on this one here. All right. Um, okay, let's end turn. Okay, maybe... I mean, we've got some level... We're level 3, right? And... Some of us are level 3, and I think some of us are level 4s. Let's come over here and see if we can kill this one. Nice crit. Okay. Mm, should we use that Valor Point to go ahead and check out the wolf? I don't think so. How about a Poison Vial? Nope. Nope, let's just save. I have a feeling moving in close like this is probably going to get their attention. But these are only half the wolves right here, so there's... Yeah, okay. Okay. Oh! Oh, she doesn't have a lot of defense, so... <gasps> nope, 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 nope. Okay, we're going to try to at least cluster up here a little bit anyway. I wish I had Beastmaster... I wish I had that Beastmaster skill so I could... Maybe maybe I could, you know, I could tame these things. Be cool. But I don't have it yet. Got to be level 5. 
All right, so Nicolas, my archers are basically... Okay, so now Nicolas is engaged. I didn't want to be engaged. He does have the run skill. Um, A new round, huh? So... Hmm. I think Banana's going to kill their attack here, spear here, and shoot. I think that's what I'm probably going to do. Which wolf goes? This wolf goes. Okay, so let's go ahead and try to get some damage on that wolf. Ah, bleeding. Boo for bleeding. Okay, let's attack this one. All right. Okay, let's move over here. Okay, now let's use you. Okay, so we're going to move over here. And let's go grab the spear. And chuck the spear. And shoot. Alright, okay, well. I mean, the wolf got some damage. Did its thing. But uh, we did our thing. And dropped the wolf. Yeah, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to use our we're gonna have to use a valor point to run. We're out of here. Nice hit. Alright, here we go. Hoping I'm hoping this one here is not going after my art. Okay. Alright, I'll take it. I'll take it. Seventy three wages to pay, huh? Okay, a new round is starting. All right, so... Princess, can you move... Yes, you can. Giddy up. All right. Poison Vial. I do not want to get Banana in the Poison Vial. Let's get the three wolves in the Poison Vial. And then... Let's do that. And then I think... Let's Axe Throw to get the kill. Or not. But that's a poison and a bleed that's going to proc on that wolf, so... Uh-oh. Oh, Princess is in trouble. She's the only one with heal, too. Oh, engaged by this one. So I could wrath this one to be able to get a full attack on that one. Let's do that. I'm going to wrath there. Get a full attack and engage there. Oh wow, he almost he almost got the got the one hitter quitter. Okay. Okay. Let's move Nick over here. Finish the job. Soon, hopefully, he could start to actually tame these animals. Because I took Beastmaster, and I plan to take the the Beastmaster skill thing with him. Uh, food. Nice. Steam fang. Leather. Oops. Okay. I can repair them all. And I don't have what it takes to heal them. Let's head up to the woodcutter's camp real quick. Alright, woodcutter's camp. Okay. Huh? The chief is worried about us, and so he should be. The locals are getting more vindictive by the minute. They harass us, and we haven't enough men to send a message. And what? Watch out! The farmer's back! Oh no, I can't go into a fight. You there, mercenaries, since the chief sent you, hurry up and join our lads outside the camp and stop these fools from getting in. I'm going to be completely honest with you. The uh, the refugees are really... I mean, they seem to really... I mean, they, I don't know, they're getting a bad rap. I don't know if they're getting a bad rap, but man, they're getting constantly attacked. Um, we've, we're, we're broken and busted and all kinds of stuff. But I think we're going to come to their aid in the next episode. Oh, look at that. That's got to hurt. What a... Oh, cancel. What a... Does that hurt? I could have restarted the Matthias Lund battle and retreated. All right. We're going to go ahead and wrap this episode up. Until the next one, stay safe. Stay healthy. Make sure you hit that like button and subscribe if you've enjoyed the video. And feel free to leave comments. Bye, everybody.